Hey, hey, how's it going, everybody? This is Etho, and yes, we are doing it, guys. Look at me. Look at me. <laughs> I am sweating profusely right now for your enjoyment because we are going to be playing. That's right. Crash Landing, guys. <laughs> so if you don't know what this is about, this is uh, a little mod pack that, that was put together. It's available on the Feed the Beast launcher, and it's a survival-based, like, difficult, challenging type of mod pack, I believe, which is this, this type of stuff I like. You guys told me about this, decided to check it out today, and yes, I think this is going to be awesome. So we have this thermometer gauge, we have a thirst meter... We got our hunger meter, and there's the the hearts, of course. And yes, it is in hardcore mode. So I think if I die, that's it. I lose. Um, if we go outside, look at this. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I got heat stroke. Um, I'm going to die before I'm done the intro here. Yeah, we are on some terrible wasteland type of world. There's not a tree in sight. There's nothing. And we're cooped up in this 400 degrees bakery right now. <laughs> Just barely surviving. Um, so yeah, this looks like a lot of fun, right? Yeah, for sure. Okay. Uh, this mod pack has this quest mod in it too, which I've always wanted to try out. So it says, to start your quest book, use HQM. HQM. Oh, did that not do it? Quest, quest, yes, I'm a genius. I can read. There we go. <laughs> oh, there's talking. Click here to start. I, I'm, or should we read this? I'm kind of 50 50 right now. We're about to die, but this could be important. Okay, it says, Hello and welcome. I am Impa, or to be more precise, intelligent multi purpose assistant. I am here to aid and guide you in surviving on this hot, dusty planet. If you were my assistant, you would stop talking to me and give me water. <laughs> says, the good news is that you seem to have survived the crash landing fine. The bad news is that th is that shuttle most definitely did not. You are stuck here for the foreseeable future. Speaking of which, you might want to get started setting up camp, gather what supplies are left in the wreck, and then see about finding water. It is mighty dry out here. I want water first, please. <laughs> All right, so there is like a quest tree type of thing here. We're on basic survival. That's cool. It's got percentage complete. Um, oh wait, what was that other thing? Lives. Hardcore mode is not active. You have an infinite amount of lives. I don't know. I tried a world and killed myself and it destroyed the world. Are you sure? Okay, anyway. <laughs> Etho is at zero. Okay, 35% thirst. Let's move on here. Let's get to it. Party, quests. How do I start a quest? Open. Okay, here we go. Here we go. What has gone before? Gathering supplies. Well, that is a mess. Grab what you can from the wreck and watch out for that detached engine. The core has been breached and the fuel is leaking. Um, tasks of this type do not have to be handed in. Having them in one's inventory is enough. However, you must have all the items at once. Also, that camel pack. What camel pack? This thing? Oh, okay. Oh, this is our rewards. We get water. Okay, that's what we want. <laughs> Let's do this. However, you must have... We read that. Camel packs are filled with water bottles in crafting grid. You can use an empty bottle to empty one if you wish. I don't quite understand. I think I'm a little delirious here because I am about to die. But let's let's get to it. So wait, what did we need to do? Oh, okay. We got to get get one of these or two of these fluid transposers. It's said to look around the ship. I see them right here. I can't just break these though, right? Uh, is there more of them? Needle gun ammo. Okay. In case of emergency, break everything. Give me that. <laughs> Okay, we got goodies in there. Here, let's let's do this really quick because I think uh, gotta break these. Good. I have them, Impa. Give me water now, please. Okay, that unlocked things. I did not get a reward though. Oh, I have to click it probably. There we go. Claim reward. <gasps> oh yeah, we did it. <laughs> what did we get? We got oh, we got lots of water. Awesome. 
cold water and then there's regular water. We are about dead. Let me drink something. That was regular water. That gave us 10% of our thirst back, which is interesting. Okay. So what about cold water? What's this going to do? Okay, that was more like, I think that was about 25%. I'm going to drink all this water. I, I hope this wasn't supposed to last a while. <laughs> um, oh, yeah, and the camel pack. I think we can wear this, is what it said, and like do this. Fills it up with water. That's cool. Each of these adds 25 to it. That fills it up totally. Aha! Cool. <laughs> so hopefully uh, I'm okay. We good to go now? 40, oh man, 40 degrees. I think 37 is body temperature and like 41 is death or something, if I remember right. So that's uh, a little scary. Okay. Okay. What what else do we do now? Let's check this out. Uh, important information. If you die and lose the map, simply generate a new world. Yada, yada, yada. Oh, something just changed. Heat stroke is gone. Yes, that is good. What has gone before? If you don't care about the backstory, you can ignore this quest safely. You lost your data tablet in the crash. It contains, among other things, all your personal logs. However, you see something glittering in the sun near the shuttle. Check it out. Oh, that's cool. So you actually have to go adventure out and do stuff, too. I like that. Um, all right. Desperate times. The very basics. That sounds good. As part of my m functions, I can replicate needed items if provided with the raw materials. My capacity is limited at this point, so I can't provide much. Sift some of the dust to get bone meal. With that, one dust and a bottle of water, I can provide you an essential survival material. And we get more water from this, so this might be worth doing. Make sure you plant something in the dirt right away. Oh no, what is going on? No, 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 no. <laughs> we might have trouble with this quest. <laughs> what? Okay. We're cool. Oh, he's got some sand. Bring me that sand. I think I need it. You know, I probably should have closed the door. Would have been a good idea to close the door. I don't know if I can break these blocks. With no, I won't get them back, I don't think. Aw, oh, man. <laughs> okay. What? What? <laughs> oh no, look at out there. There's a giant crater now. Are they... Are the creepers just blowing up or are they stepping in the fire? I think they're stepping in the fire. Oh no. They are getting really close. Is this blast proof? That was like one block away from our, our home here. I think we lost the corner here, didn't we? Okay. <laughs> um, I might have just lost. I'm not sure. Dirt, bone meal, water. <laughs> I am just like stunned right now. Um, okay, I don't know if we can do that. Desperate times. You may have noticed the lack of food on this planet. While I have a temporary solution, you aren't going to like it much, but given the only alternative is starving to death, you see all that dust around you? While well, I am reading high concentrations of salt, I'm positive you can, you, you can get useful amounts just by doing a little sifting. Sticking a salt water bottle in a furnace. Oh, okay. That would also work, although it ruins the bottle. <laughs> this is going to go on forever, isn't it? <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> oh. Maybe I should have, like, blocked that leak with some sand or something. I don't know. I really want to, uh... Check out what was in that chest there, but I can't now. 
These are not normal mobs either. That guy had a headband for crying out loud. Okay, can I like inch my way closer? I wonder. Bad idea, bad idea, bad idea. Nope, nope, nope. Please go outside. Ah. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna try this again. I think it's gone. Yeah, it's dead. I'm ah. Close the door next time. Lesson learned. I'm letting all the heat out. Okay, guys. So that didn't count. That was just that was just the intro. We were testing things. We know now that it will delete the world, and that's what we were trying to figure out there. Totally intentional. Let's play for real now, though, shall we? So we got our quest book again here. Let's do this. We're, we're so pro. Look at this. Oh, click on that. All done. Grab these. Oh, yes. Claim the reward. Like a boss. Good. <laughs> and we're pretty much where we were 10 minutes ago in on this thing so that is great such progress and fill that put it on good um next quest it said we needed to get um sand i think or or dust was it dust yeah we have to sift it it says okay and this says we should try to get some salt um so maybe we will just take a quick look around our our place here <laughs> like we didn't do last time. So this is a needle gun. Look at this thing. This is crazy looking. It's like the most powerful weapon in the world, but we had these on the crack pack, <laughs> and I can tell you it is not. It is the equivalent of punching something at, at long range. It is so weak. <laughs> like, this thing is almost useless. Um, unless it's been powered up in this, I'm not sure. Some reading materials here. Oh, we got tinkers. Very good. We probably need to make tinker tools as our starter tools. Maybe, or maybe vanilla tools work too. We'll find out. Uh, open blocks. That's just something I've noticed. Like I've played a few of these little mod packs on the side just for fun. And uh, usually if there's tinkers, they remove the vanilla recipe. We got an oak sieve, crafting station, Quest delivery system. Is that part of this mod? Oh, it is. Okay, so these two probably go hand in hand somehow. And beef jerky. Delicious. Nutritious. And some capacitors. We probably don't need these right away, so I'm just going to leave those there. <laughs> Let's close the door. <laughs> um, actually, maybe not close it, but let's get ready to close it, just in case. Um... I get distracted here or something. <laughs> yeah, let's just close it. You know what? Let's make that our habit. We always close the door when we go inside. All right. Um, and since since it's a one-time, one-life deal, I'm gonna carry all my good stuff on me at all times, probably because there's no point uh, trying to protect it or anything like that. So let's get this down. Crafting table. Quest delivery system. What do you do to to me? You don't do anything. You currently have not bound a quest to the QDS. So somehow... Oh, you know, this might be for automating the quest somehow. We will find out later. It's probably not too important right now. Uh, anyway, so let's go outside and take a look around the crash site this time. Um, so there is water here. Am I able to refill these water bottles, I wonder? Uh, it gave us... Oh, it gave us salt water, not regular water. And I'm guessing I don't want to drink salt water. <laughs> hey, it gave us thirst! Like, not thirst, but... Uh, oh, then we get a dehydration thing, though. <gasps> oh, that is clever. I was not expecting that. I thought I cheated the system already. All right. Okay. So don't drink salt water. Like it did give us some some of our bar back here, but then I guess dehydration takes most of it away. Um, okay. Is there anything? I don't think you're supposed to really be outside during the day. Like you lose your thirst quicker or something, or you heat up quicker. Let's grab some some of this. 
So this is not sand, it is actually dust. I was expecting to find something hidden here, but I guess not. Do you see anything? No. <laughs> I think we're I think we're stranded here for real. There's no uh 7-Eleven around the corner there. So let's head back quickly. My temperature isn't really going up though. I'm at 37 degrees. Oh! Oh, I thought that was fall damage. We're good. Should we try to uh, stop this leak, I wonder? Yeah, I'm not heating up at all. This is great. Maybe because I have so much... Uh oh, it's the camel pack that's saving me, probably. As soon as I wa run out of water, though, it's, it's probably going to be bad. Oh, <laughs> I was just about to jump on that. This might not be so smart. I just want to... Is this smart? I don't know. This might be a terrible idea. Oh, no, 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 no. We're good. We're okay. Look at this thing. I think it's catching fire quicker now. Okay. Is there anything around here that we need? Let's just check around. Dig it up a little bit, maybe. Does this go down deeper? No, that's it. Okay. So it's probably just like a case and that stuff is inside. I don't think it's actually something you go into. Okay, we'll grab lots of this dust. Because I have a feeling we're going to be stuck inside at night and probably have to like grind out materials or something. I'm not sure. Still at 37 degrees. This camel pack is doing work. I like it. Okay. What time is it? Oh, we still got time. It's not too bad. Maybe we will go inside, though. And try to do some more of these quests. I have a feeling getting some stuff early on here is really important. Because uh, I saw dirt was one of the rewards, right? So, do you just put this in? Oh, yeah, look at this. Oh, that looks really neat. That is really cool. <laughs> I've, seen, uh, I've seen people using these... Um, before, but I've never tried them myself. I never really understood what they were for. I guess you just... Are we getting random materials from it, I suppose? Glowstone, lead, quartz, copper, silver. Okay. Well, that's pretty cool. So you must... Uh, this must be how we get our metals and stuff. Did I get an egg? Oh, come on. Look at this. We're going to get four chickens. <laughs> And we will have food for days. Ah. It was worth a shot. Okay, actually I am getting kind of hungry here. Okay, so did I do any of these quests by doing this? Yeah, we did the salt one. Good. How do I claim the reward? Oh. Oh, I see. There's more than one part to it. That's what this is for. I was like, <laughs> why do you click on this? It doesn't do anything. But there's two things. We need rotten flesh as well. We can probably get that uh, when they burn up in the day pretty easily. So let's not worry about that. Uh, this one. Dust, bone meal, and water bottle. Don't we have all that stuff? We have water bottle. We have bone meal. Yeah, I think we got it. Manual submit. Oh, okay, there we go. Aha! <laughs> so that gave us a piece of dirt. It says to plant something in it right away, but I don't have anything to plant. So sapling. Sapping the saplings. Transposer, you will... Oh. I have found a way to get water. If you drop saplings in the liquid transposer, you will get a little bit of water out of them. One in tenth... One tenth of bucket. Oh, so if you have extra saplings, I guess. Remember, you can power the transposers with the flux capacitors in your emergency supply chest. Make sure you do not use up all your saplings. Whoops. Okay. That's one way of getting water, I guess. How do we actually get saplings, I wonder? Drinking mud. The hard roots, the easy roots. Tools of the trade. Mm. Oh, okay. Rewards birch sapling. What is this? Choose this path if you want a challenge. Expect to die. <laughs> a lot 
Notes, choosing this path will disable the easy route quest. Oh, man. Enable zombie awareness. Be aware, however, that it sometimes causes lag. Hmm. Well, I definitely want to go to the, har the harder route here, I think. <laughs> PP and J. Oh, it gives you a leadstone energy cell and all kinds of stuff. All right, we're going to the hard route. The hard route here. Claim reward. Yes. Okay, cool. So we got a sapling. Two saplings, actually. Let's go outside really quick. Oh, it's getting night. Let's plant these. Let's plant these really quick. Which is better? I think we'll go with birch. No mobs yet. That's good. Close the door. <laughs> you know what? I just had an idea. We probably should have planted that sapling uh, indoors <laughs> somewhere. Like maybe we might have been able to plant, like put dirt here and planted it here. That way we could have like grown it with bone meal and chopped it down inside. All right. Look at that guy. Oh man, there's baby creepers. <laughs> He just ran by. That's awesome. Ninja skeletons. You don't want to mess with the ninjas. That's for sure. Alright. Let's not go out there. I'm getting a little hungry. Let's try out this beef jerky. That was weird. Is it a hunger effect thing? Oh, well fed. That gives you health regen. Oh, okay. Let's not waste these then. I think. I think that's... Oh, uh, maybe not. Ooh, these guys are loud. Okay. Okay. Um... What do we do during night? I guess we can read some more. So, we need... Don't do that one. Water is scarce in a pinch. You can get water from dirt. One bottle and one dirt, and there you go. It isn't very healthy, but if you don't have a choice, we don't have any extra dirt. Tools of the trade. To survive out there, to survive out here, you will need some basic tools, a weapon, and some protection from attack. Yes, please. Okay. Full guard pattern. Don't forget, you can upgrade to metal hammers later. Did it actually want me to do anything? Or is this like, take what you want type thing? Okay, I get it. I wasn't really sure what it wanted me to do here, but I guess I have to make a stone hammer and a bone crook, huh? Isn't that for, like, herding sheep? I think. Anyway, <laughs> so I've been uh, processing some of this dust. Got another egg. More blaze powder there. Gives you all kinds of crazy random stuff. Oh, what was that? Oh, it just, it looked weird because it was showing a bunch of them clumped together. <laughs> it looked like a, it was like showing the dust with over top the bone meal and it looked like a crazy hairball or something. I don't know. Um, Alright, we're just about out of dust. I don't think we can really do anything else further in the quest tree until we get some wood. Although I wonder, I can you make wooden tools? You must be able to, because I don't have any stone either. Mm. <laughs> it gets so loud at night. Look at this, man. Isn't that crazy? Oh, I would not want to get trapped outside. None of them really in the front here. They seem to track me pretty good. Like, if I go to the front, they come to the front. If I go to the back, they seem to follow me there. <laughs> Walrus zombies. Uh-huh. Okay. My camel pack is out of water. Has me worried, because I still don't know how to get water. <laughs> well, I know how to get water, but I don't have any way to get water. I should say. Um... So we got blaze powder. Let's throw this egg. Yeah, nothing. What do we use this for? Oh, you can make cobblestone from this if you have four. Okay. Probably should have figured that out sooner. What is salt used for? Let's find out. Whoa. Dough? 
Okay, salt, flour, water bucket, mixing bowl. Does that to make butter? Oh, this is cool. This is like cooking in this. Ice cream, cheese, potato soup. Oh, I like that. That's neat. Hunger overhaul. I've never heard of that mod. Oh, and this is the, the stuff we're eating. This jerky, too. Oh. Spicy mustard pork. <laughs> oh, this one looks simple. What is this? Sunflower seeds and salt. Okay. And beef jerky is... Can I use rotten? No. We got to try to find the simplest thing here. I think the simplest one was probably this one here. So two salt and a rotten flesh. Hopefully that gives us a bit of food. Alright. Okay, so I'm basically just going to wait for day here. We're going to run around, pick up the mob drops, and then bone meal that tree, get some wood, make some tinker's tools, and go from there. I think that's the plan. <laughs> I'm I'm comfy inside my little shelter here while you guys burn out there. Although the creepers won't, will they? I just realized. I'm starting to clue in, like I had a moment to think now, <laughs> how this is going to work. So if we get stone, cobblestone, we can probably make a furnace from that. Smelt down these ores we're getting, like all this dust. I'm guessing. Maybe not. And then we can start making like machines and stuff, I think is how this is going to go. We're just about safe to go. He's got armor on. <laughs> um, how safe is it going to be out here? See, some of these guys run really quick, though, I think is the problem. I got the needle gun, and that's about it. I'm kind of worried, like, a little guy is going to run underneath here and, like, <laughs> blow everything up. No, this isn't going to work. We need more ways out of here. We can't just have one door. Can we get out the top here? <laughs> Probably not. <gasps> Dude, he saw me through the corner. Are you kidding me? That is not fair. Okay, we got some bone meal from that anyway. I think if I'm not by the door, they just kind of leave me alone. <laughs> Run around. Let's get all the mob drops we can. Because they're probably pretty valuable. Rotten flesh is food. Arrows are defense. And offense. He went inside my building. I just saw that. Did you see that guy running my building? Got a flint somehow. Alright, running is probably very bad in this mod pack though. <laughs> whoa, whoa, quick guy. And he stole my glass. He just stole my glass. Are you kidding me? You better burn. His Oh, his helmet just broke. Here, can you mine some, some dust for me, please? Thank you. <laughs> I'm not mining this dust. Are you crazy? We got little helpers for that. What is... I don't know what that guy is. That is a big creeper. <laughs> Alright. Just gotta get the right distance and it works perfect. Good. Okay, now it's too quiet. Where did that guy go with my glass? He burnt up somewhere. Oh, great. Oh, 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 oh. Don't blow up on the house. Okay, needle gun time. No. No. Alright, blow up, blow up. Thank you. <laughs> I am starving, apparently. We're good. I got a hang of this. Don't you worry, guys. <laughs> Look at all this dust. We're we're golden. This is like infinite materials right here. I'm going to get the needle gun ready just in case we get another surprise. Okay. I think that guy walked off with our glass, unfortunately. Uh, I'm trying to get indoors right now just so we can recover for a second. There's one more creeper. Well, there's a couple more creepers. <laughs> okay. 
You know what we should build? Maybe... F oh, that's still burning. Pretty high priority. We should probably build some sort of a wall. Like defensive wall around our place. Alright, I need more dust. Oh. Perfect. Excellent. More dust. Thank you. And we're probably good to go inside. I, I want to be careful here, though. Because that one guy might still be in here. Oh, he dropped the... Look, he dropped the glass right inside. Awesome. Close this. Well, I do kind of want to see if I can grow this with bone meal, too. Yeah, okay, good. Chop this down. Great. We are well on our way, guys. I, I have a good grasp of this now, I think. Uh, let me know what you guys think of this series, if you enjoy it. Um, I kind of would like to do a little side series like this every so often. And this is a good filler one, I would say. It's, it's fun, it's simple, something different. So I hope you enjoy it as well. And I will see you again in the next episode, if I'm still alive. <laughs> All right. Have a good day. Bye-bye.